Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, and we're here with episode 3 of Uncharted Drake's Fortune. In the previous episode, we've managed to escape um, Roman and Navarro's guards uh, with Elena, and we ended up taking a plane out of there and ended up landing in the forest where we got separated, and we pretty much just went through that whole chapter, so we completed um, a surprising find and plane wrecked. And got all the treasures in there. So we're at the fortress now, which is just at the very start of the level, as you could, as you saw at the end of the last episode. And now I plan, if we manage to get as far away, far into this as um, I hope, we should be getting eight treasures this episode. Three of them are all very close together at the very start of the episode. Uh, which we'll be getting to in a moment, um, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh, you can't be serious. But I mean, we managed to get. We managed to do pretty well last time. I wasn't expecting that we'd finish all of chapter four, but we managed to just a bit scrape it. Nope. Don't do that, Drake. Seriously. Oh, Nate. Whatever. Right. Nope. Gotta be careful around these stone walls. Don't want to make any silly jumps, you know what I mean? Yep. Here we go. Yeah, of course it will. No worries. Yeah. Alright, so we're coming up to that area now. We've just got some guys to take out beforehand, so we'll leave it until then. No one is over here. I don't want you talking about. Alright, fools. Who's having a go? We need to move out, I can't see these fools. No, you don't. Just, I think I've just got this one last guy up here. He's over there. He's over there. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Hello. You popped up out of nowhere. That's the way to do it. Alright. Seriously, no one's just got random regular this ammo. You tight bastards. Anyone? Euler? No. Alright, so um, our first treasure that we're going to get is this one. It's just right on the roof here, if Nate decides he's going to actually jump rather than, you know, be silly. Alright, and this is the strange relic, which kind of throws off the treasures, because it counts as one, but also is separate in its own way. So, yeah, this is one that will get you a unique trophy, if it's your first time playing through, of course. Uh, which is the one that actually brings the tally up to 61, instead of 60. Alright, um... The other two are also very close by. Thank God someone's finally got some ammo. <laughs> finally some good fucking ammo. Alright, um, I want to jump over this debris and check out this little thing. I don't know what it is. We've got the silver jaguar. There you go. Alright, we've done around here. Now we're going to pop down here. Now we've got a firefight coming up in just a mole. But if we come back around and back over this bit of debris. We've got our third treasure, which should be in this corner. The Gold Mosaic Inca Earring. So there you go, there is three out of hopefully the eight we're going to pick up today, so I'll just keep a mental note. Alright. Be prepared for the battle. Shut up. Shut your pie hole. Right, so we've got a guy on the... Uh, The, um, LMG. So I'm just gonna be careful here. Don't do anything stupid. Now luckily, like they positioned it so that he's like nowhere near you. Like he's actually around the other side of the wall. You can just see where the bullets are impacting. Um, don't need to worry about him too much. Except them all. We should just take him out with an easy headshot. 
there. <laughs> the, this guy will walk right next to the barrel. Nate decides he's going to shoot it, of course. Alright. Pretty easy. Alright, so we're clear of collectibles for the mole. Um, it's towards the end of this chapter that the next one is. Uh, let's check. Pick up some ammo if we can. Keep a pistol locked and loaded. So, we could uh, go for the micro SMG if we wanted. But, I don't know. I, I prefer just using a uh, big yellow pistol. If you get me. Right, there's a guy who pops around here. Of course, you're going to have to waste your pistol ammo on him, and he carries the micro anyway. So, Because he's cruel like that. Okay, um. Just want to pop up the stairs here. We're all clear of enemies, so don't worry. I uh, want to head up into this little tower over here, which is, of course, where the parachute was. But, alarmingly, no sign of Elena, which is not a great thing. I don't know where she's no ended up. Of her. It's either very good or very bad. Very good. Very bad. That is the question. All right. Pintu! See up a unit, each other secara. Sealano! Buka Pintu! Ah, It worked! There he is! Up there! Get on the gun! Oh boy. <laughs> Not quite as you intended, did it, Nate? Alright. At least the gate's open now so we can progress. Progression is good. Get away from that gun. I didn't work out too well for you, did it? Let me throw that grenade. I need to go out to school. <laughs> oh, now you have been schooled. Fools better be using pistols. Because I'm out. Well, not out, but. I have a limited amount of ammunition. And I would quite like a top up if that's alright. Thank you. Somebody has some common sense. Do you have one? No. Of course you don't. Alrighty, well, at least everyone's down. Let's head through here. Now, the next treasure is close by, but we're also closing up on the end of this chapter as well, so. There's a guy down here who's gonna. I think he's all that and get on the SMG, so shoot the barrel otherwise. I mean, you can shoot him whilst he's on the gun, of course, but then you want to have not the debris, which is what gets into the next section. Uh, but for now, we've got a guy who's up here. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um. Good bar ammo, good stuff. And our final treasure of this chapter is here the golden spoon. Spoon! Alright, there we go. Cool. Uh, else. we're not going to need anything else, we've fully stocked up on both, haven't we? Alright, now this next section is infamously difficult on uh, the longer, the uh, harder difficulties. Uh, definitely took me a little while with them. Uh, of course it's not, not so bad on lower difficulties. Taking up here and out. Appear from the other. Appear from this direction now. Hey! Cheating! Cheating! Hey! Hey! What are you doing? Is everybody? 
I think it is. No. No. Hey! Dude, how many bullets do you need? Christ almighty. Alright. We took up half my ammo. Cheeky bastards. Anyone got pistol ammo? I'm taking pistol ammo. Any pistol ammo will do. I saw ya. Okay, uh, I want to clamp these rough, these um, little scaffolding over here. What I do is edge our way around. Head through this little gate. Alright, and head down this way, I believe. Yeah. Well, over this way. Because the water's too low for us to progress, so we're going to need to change that through a conveniently eroded walls, as per usual. Alright. Come on. Come on. Let's open the floodgates. There we go. Let's just jump across the other one because so the water will still rise when we're in it. So. Alright. And now we can just head over to the other side and open this one. Oh. Up you go, kiddo. And there we go, which should raise it enough so that we can grab onto this little ledge over here. Alright, I think we should be closing up on the chapter. Yep. There we go, unlocking the past. Jesus, Elena, where are you? <laughs> Where'd you go? Hmm. Huh. Wait a minute. Hey, that diddly down second. What's so important about that tower? Hey! Son of a bitch. Again, this was a big pain in the ass of an area when I was playing on the harder difficulties. Just don't give you a break in this game. <laughs> it's quite liberating just to mow through these guys like no one's business. And previously, we were kind of cowering behind a wall like, Have you done shooting? So I can nearly die just to take down one person or injure him a little bit. No. Hey. You stop getting up close and personal, huh? Yahoo. Come on, Nate, heal up a little bit. There we go. It's just this guy left. Come on. That's the way to do it. Uh, okay, right, so we've got our next treasure in this area. Uh, is it through here? No, it's not. Um, hmm. Which one was it? it might be this one. Where were you? I forgot. Oh, it might be a. Uh, might have been back this way. Hang on a mo. No. Ah, oh, where, where was this one? It just eluded me. Oh, there it is. It's behind the tree. Alright. So we've got a silver Inca mask. There you go. So that is number five out of eight. Just keeping, keeping turtles. Keeping turtles. Oop. Oh, fully stopped. I thought we would run out of ammo. Huh. What's this? What is this? Who do you think you are? All right. Uh, oh, walking past it. I'm gonna climb up here. We're gonna do a bit of parkouring if Nate feels like he's up to it. 
the dancers. And 80. Parkour. Dude, come on. Work with me. Alright. Whee. Destroying old, very old land architecture. Very depressing. And another quick time event. Just to keep you on your toes. Okay. Hit on up. Hit on up. Jump across. Jump across. Oh, oh you, uh, Nate. Seriously. Why are you like this? Thank God there's no uh, trophies relating to never dying across a whole playthrough because sometimes you could do everything right and Nate would just be an idiot. Dems, of, dems the rules. Uh, okay, so we're carrying going up. So we can head into the lighthouse. Well, not the lighthouse, but whatever that is, just a tower, maybe. Maybe you can actually move and jump across rather than just screaming, No! You're not Darth Vader. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, careful. Camera angles, you make me want to hurt myself. No, not that way. Oh my word. Nate. Don't do it. It's not worth it. You don't want to make me angry. Excuse me. Thank you. There we go. We got the keys. We got plunk. Alright, now we've got the keys. We can get through the door, which I actually never showed you. <laughs> Obviously, that's just me playing the game a hundred times. Knowing what you need to do. So now you get your keys, you can open this door with the convenient key symbol over it. Oh, he just mutters to himself, isn't he? Yeah, all right, all right, okay, very cool. Where the hell is she? Where'd he go? All right, another big firefight area where there's a couple of treasures around. Bastards. Just you two fools left. Oh, hey. Come on, you bastard, heal up. Ball me there, didn't you? Right, I'm gonna need some ammo, please. Anybody got any ammo? No, not a micro SMG. If I wanted a micro SMG, I would have asked for one. Just general pistol ammo, please. Hmm? Okay. Right, let's get our treasure. The Spanish silver coin. Lovely. That is number six out of eight, if I'm not mistaken, which I know I'm not, because... Sure. <laughs> okay, head through here. 
Who's ready for an ass kicking? You've annoyed me now. You actually killed me and you've, you're making me having to edit. Again. You'll regret it. Hey. Right there, Nate. Right. Do you have to do this to me? No, I'm. Right. No, get me to do that. Uh, screw you. That's right. Get your booty down. Everybody? You're damn right, that's everybody. You're goddamn right. Okay, and our next treasure should be just around this corner. The silver Ty Tyrona pendant. So there you go. Merry Christmas. Okay, Um. Alright, let's sit through here. These aren't Spanish, they're English. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, oh, indeed. Fletcher, we have gone to the Great Tower. I pray that you will meet us there. Francis Drake. Wow. So you made it. But what were you plotting? Uh oh. I see you there with your shotgun. Come on. Come on. Right there. Gonna play the game. That's what I thought. Alright. So got one more treasure coming up pretty soon. That must be Drake's tower. It must be. Hey. Don't avoid my bullets. There you go. That showed you. Right, I'm going to need some regular pistol bullets, so if you could stop being so arsy and just saying, like, oh, you got to get with the new guns now if you want to keep up your ammo. Urgh. Okay, so our final treasure that we'll be getting this episode is, if we come back here... Rather than going right, which it, the game wants us to, and even shoving the camera down our face as it wants us to, I'm going to grab this bad boy over here, the Golden Llama. Very good. So we're almost halfway done through the treasures. Only six chapters into the episode. So that's pretty cool. Alright. Alrighty, so... Oh. Careful, Nate. No! What was that? What was that? Honestly, help me out here, buddy. Because I am unsure what your motives are sometimes. It's not jumping across to me, does it? Hmm. Hmm. 
All right. Break in the wall. Just another break in the wall. Hey. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. Stop being bitchy. Stop being bitchy. Okay. Ah, here we are. This must have been Drake's. So what were you looking for, huh? Hmm. Well now, that looks familiar. Huh. The ship's never left. Elena. Hey, there she is. Uh oh. So okay. Oh. Knockout. Knockout. Bum bum bum. I know I'm not a big time treasure hunter like you, but I doubt you're gonna find El Dorado in there. How'd you get yourself in this mess? Trying to rescue you, as a matter of fact. Oh, that's so sweet. Traditional sandstone brick and stucco, limestone mortar, huh? How'd you get to know so much about this? My show. Episode 4, Architects of a New World. Yep, it'll just take a tug to pull these bars out. What? No, wait, are you sure? Get out of my way, puto! Hey, Batan, open this goddamn door! Oh, crap. Hey, Drake. Daddy Raja. <laughs> I should have guessed. Fascinating document, huh? Seems like this Sir Francis was in my line of work. Don't flatter yourself, Eddie. <laughs> Always ready to be enemies, eh? <laughs> Tell you what, lead me to the gold, and I just might let you live. <laughs> Is that it? Is that my deal? Die now, or help you, and die later. That's oh, a tough call, but you know what? I'll take die now. Die, Gabo! Listen to me, maggots. I was promised treasure on this goddamn rock. And now, my men are dying. They can't even go outside to take a piss without an armed guard. And I have nothing to show for it! I am making you a fair offer. You help me find the treasure. And the last man alive gets the gold. And the girl, of course. The girl? Oh, Eddie, the girl's long gone. She's probably off the island by now. Going for help. Dai Kuching, you were never very good at poker. I will find her. Trust me. How much trouble could one girl be? guys um just once again once we just get into the action that is of course where i'm going to have to end it because the this whole thing is just a chapter it's about eight minutes long so it's going to take us over time if we don't so let's just make a save there we'll pick up right back into this in the next episode so we're at 44 percent of the way through guys out of the frying pan very good indeed Okay, so that is where we're going to end it for today. In the next episode, we will, of course, escape Eddie Raja and his men and see where it takes us from there to finding El Dorado. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And also be sure to share the video. I'll see you guys in episode four. Everything Bye, guys. Changes.